Together, we begin tonight with a most unusual search near Danville. The search is for some monkeys that managed to escape a truck involved in a crash while en route to a lab. WBRE 28, WYOU 22 Eyewitness News reporter Madonna Mantione joins us live in Valley Township with the very latest. Good evening, Madonna. Good evening, Mark. Four of those monkeys got loose this afternoon after a truck hauling about 100 of them crashed here on Route 54 near the Danville exit of Interstate 80. Now, state police and the Game Commission are still on scene, but this story prompted a local animal loving family to help. When word got out that these three pound monkeys were on the loose in Danville Friday night, the Allen family sprang into action. And we just decided to come and try, see if we could find one. These Montoursville residents are animal lovers and drove half an hour to search the woods along Route 54 just off Interstate I 80. That's the spot where state police and game wardens searched for the primates. I saw it on Facebook, and actually, it started as kind of a family fun joke about just making an experience and going to try to save a monkey. <laughs> so I actually brought a kennel, flashlights, night vision goggles. The bitter cold did not deter their efforts to lend a hand. Yeah, so, we were worried because um, my one friend is a state police officer and she's like, you know, they can't be out there that long. So we were like, oh no. The Allen family wasn't able to find any of the monkeys, but they might consider adopting one in the future. Me and my dad saw on um, an app that we have that like people have pet monkeys so we really wanted to get one. Now game wardens have not yet said if any of the monkeys have been located, but if you do spot one, they are asking the public to keep a distance and call 911 mark. Now earlier Madonna you and I were talking that you said you heard some noises coming from the woods. Uh, could you describe what exactly you heard? Yeah, Mark, we heard about three very loud pops coming from this wooded area. Now, we don't know what that was or if it was related to the search, but we will keep you updated both on air and online as this developing story progresses. And also, Madonna, do we know what the plans are for the search going forward if they don't find the monkeys in the next hour or so? Well, it's very cold out here tonight, Mark, but we don't know if that plays a factor into the search or if they will be searching tomorrow. Right when we get off this live, we're going to ask officials again to get the updated word. All right, Madonna Mantillon reporting live for us tonight near Danville. Obviously, the sooner those monkeys are found, the better.